pallets and mussels or something ridiculous. So I was just on my, you know, I was just getting, I was just pulling, picking up a bit of paper off the printer at home, just ready to hop in the car to the meeting, and it just, I twisted, funny, and just went. <clears throat> as simple as that, and then I was alright that day, but I couldn't drive, I couldn't get in the car, because it was too sensitive, you know, delicate. So I worked from home, I thought, ah, oh, crash out in the morning, I'll be fine, and get back on track, and uh, couldn't get out of bed in the morning. <laughs> So two and a half days later, I managed to hobble out with a walking stick. You know? <laughs> Kids running around complaining that they're uh, my carer and things like this. You know? No, <laughs> first of all, they thought I was like, winging it. You know, oh yeah, he wants to cut the days off work. Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah. And then when they saw me sort of collapse on the floor, like a sack of shit, they thought well, maybe he isn't. <laughs> But anyway, it's better, but it's still a little bit. I still got to be careful, yeah, but I'm going to have to give myself to a chiropractor, I think, and, and get down to the gym and do some exercises or something on 